Hey babies. So I'm about to finally cook my chorizo, y'all. I haven't cooked this in so long. So uh it's um chorizo quesadillas, y'all. So what I do is I fry some bacon. I'm gonna cut it up as it get to cooking and I'm gonna add some onions and bell peppers and then I add this in there and then I will just make like quesadillas. But I'll show y'all that step once all of this is cooked and put together, okay? So I'm just going to fry my bacon. I'm not going to drain none of the grease. I'm going to add my chorizo. And I'm about to cut up some onion and bell pepper. And that's it. And I don't think I seasoned this. Yeah, the only season that I used was um, the um, just a little bit of seasoning to do my, uh, my, my corn tortillas. All right here, y'all. This is what I'm using for my husband. And then um, I probably do some regular tortillas too because I can't remember which one he actually liked. And this is the pork and chicken. I made the beef last time, so I don't know how this is going to taste, but hopefully it's good. All right, y'all. So I will show y'all in the next clip how everything looks. So here I just cut up my bacon and I added some bell pepper onion and jalapenos. I should have never added those jalapenos because I know they're going to be hot. Those are some of the ones that my husband had grilled the other day. So I'm going to let this get done, and then I'm going to add the uh, chorizo. Okay, baby, so I have now put the chorizo in there, and I'm just going to let that cook up. And then when it's done, I will show y'all how I do my quesadillas. I have a little bit of oil cooking up in the same uh, juice and seasonings and stuff that um, the chorizo just came out of. It doesn't have to cook for long at all, y'all. So I just set this to the side because I'm going to make my husband breakfast with this in the morning, too. Just add some eggs to it. But I just got some grease up in here. And then I'm going to sit my tortillas in here and add cheese, uh, some of the mixture, and then just do it like a quesadilla. So I'll show y'all. <laughs> so this is them cooking, y'all. I forgot to show y'all how it looks um, when I first put them in there, but i let y'all see it in the next clip. So this is what it looks like when I first put them in there. So I don't know if I told y'all, but I added a little grease and then I added a little seasoning with the grease. And I just put them on there. I don't usually cook them like this together, y'all. But I'm trying to hurry up. So I just put a little, I don't know if y'all can see the cheese. Some uh, pepper jack shredded cheese. And on this one, I put pepper jack shredded cheese as well. But on one of the other ones, I had put just sliced cheese. And then I put the mixture on top. And I'm going to get ready to flip it, okay? And I just simply take my fork and just flip the side that don't have the mixture on it. Just like that, y'all. I'm trying to do this with one hand so y'all can see. Oops. Look, the fog don't want to come out. Okay. <laughs> and then I do the other one the same way. And then I just flip it. And y'all, when I use corn tortillas, I try to double them. Because messing with a single corn, corn tortilla could be kind of difficult to work with. <clears throat> so I just double those. So I let them cook like five minutes all together you know it all depends on how crispy you want yours and that go to uh first two that i had just cooked i'm not gonna cook a lot because like i said i don't have a lot of well i was telling my husband that i don't have a lot of mixture and i know he won't breakfast with this so he's just gonna eat leftovers and my daughters are gonna eat they burritos with some chili and cheese on it and then this is just like a sampler just to see if i still got it <laughs> so this is them y'all they are good. They they really are good, but I got to have mine with like um, sour cream and sauce and stuff. But they really are good. I didn't like the um, Belvita jalapeno cheese. I just don't like that kind of cheese. I really have pepper jack. But my husband like it and my daughters haven't tried it yet. So, but they still good. But I would still rather have the beef instead of the pork and chicken.